This video is sponsored by Omen. What's going on guys, it's your average consumer and finally, we've got some more back to school videos. I guess I shouldn't say finally, some people are probably mad. But lo and behold, here we are for 2021. This is the back to school baller edition video. And you guys know how we do. There's gonna be a baller edition and a budget edition. Uh, but considering the fact that these videos are geared towards students, I still kept price in mind, try to keep everything on the lower end. So nothing super expensive here since students aren't balling like that. Uh, but still, if you have a little cash, these are the things you wanna invest in. Uh, so first off, we're gonna start off with the backpack. So this is the Mark Ryden, I, I think three pocket backpack. That's what they've got it called on Amazon. Uh, I saw this a long time ago while in Japan and I kind of fell in love with it. Pretty inexpensive backpack with a really stylish design. It's got this nice texture on it, so it's water resistant. Water will glide right off of this. Uh, so I like this, I like this a lot. It's nice and sleek, has tons of compartments. I believe there's a two pocket version. Three is definitely the way to go, and it only goes for 64 bucks. I had these guys, these guys were guessing the price, Carl was thinking it was like over a hundred bucks, 80 to a hundred dollars. Jay thought it was premium. He thought it was more expensive. Only $64, which I think is great considering all the compartments that you get out of this. Uh, it also has a spot for a portable charger to be plugged into it. So you have access to a USB port. So when you're on your way to school, you have your backpack on. So when you got your backpack on, you need to charge your phone. You notice, oh man, my battery is low. You could plug in your cable, plug it right into your phone, and you're using your portable charger without having to have your portable charger sit in your pocket. I absolutely love that feature when it comes to backpacks, so it makes the commute a little bit easier if you need to charge your device. I think it's safe to say we changed up the way we do these backpack videos. We start with the laptop, since there are accessories in here that go with it. So right here we've got the HP Omen 16 gaming laptop. So of course you can use this for schoolwork or if you wanna take some time to play some games after you're done, you have all the power that you need to do that. This guy can actually be configured with up to an AMD Ryzen 9 5900HX processor. You can also get up to an AMD Radeon 6600M graphics card. So if you guys wanna play some games with some pretty good settings, you'll have all the power in the world to do that. You guys know me. I'm a big Apex guy and I was able to play Apex with no issues. Everything looked really good. And you even have a Quad HD display over here that can go up to 165 Hertz. So great looking screen, lots of power. It actually feels really good to type on this. So we've got like a nice RGB lit keyboard. So feels really good. Uh, you also have a ton of ports. So you have your ethernet port. So if your school doesn't have good Wi-Fi, you can always plug in with the Ethernet port if you're a dorm student. You've also got a USB port over here, display port, HDMI, USB Type-C, headphone jack, and it even has an SD card slot, as well as two other USB Type-A ports. So we've got lots of options here in terms of connectivity and I.O. And it's also Wi-Fi 6 enabled, so if you wanna get those fast Wi-Fi speeds, you're gonna be able to do that, which is important if you're trying to get work done or play a multiplayer game online. So this thing will pretty much cover all the bases that you need when it comes to work and play. And honestly, for a 16-inch gaming laptop, I don't find this to be too heavy, so throwing it into the backpack, taking it around for school, not gonna be an issue. And I actually like the logo here. It's not like an RGB or anything, uh, but I like this gradient look, the blue to purple. It's a clean looking laptop. So if you're looking for a good laptop for back to school and you want one that can handle both work and play, definitely check this out. I'll have links down below in the description. Now, because this is the baller edition, you might have a little cash to splurge on a good monitor to go with your laptop, whether you wanna have multiple monitors for productivity, or just want a good gaming monitor so that you can play your games on a bigger screen. Over here, we have the Omen 25i gaming monitor, and this thing is solid if you wanna take it to like a dorm room or you don't have like a huge desk to work from. This thing has a 165 hertz refresh rate, and it also supports NVIDIA G-Sync as well as AMD FreeSync. So when you're gaming on this, you'll be able to really enjoy it. And what's cool about this monitor 
is that it even has a spot in the back for headphones. So if you want to throw your headphones on top of here, you got a nice spot to store it. And it's kind of dope that they have the Omen logo, that diamond over here, as well as the bottom for the stand. So if you guys are interested in checking out the Omen 25i gaming monitor, I'll have this link down below in the description as well as the laptop. So yes, that's our laptop of choice over here. We wanna be able to do it all, so we got this guy. And you can actually see the backpack itself has nice straps to keep the laptop nice and safe. And you can also add another little something over here. I don't know if you wanna put a book or a tablet. You can also do that. And you've still got this overall big pocket. And even in the back, you've got another little spot where you can throw things into maybe things you don't want anyone else to have quick access to. You can throw it back there, keep it nice and safe. People can't really recognize uh, that this is a compartment. So you can throw things in there. It's nice and padded too, so I like that. Uh, but let's go on to the front. Front has a few compartments. You got a side one, hold things like your laptop charger. So we've got the laptop charger for this guy, which also I forgot to mention has about nine hours of battery life. Uh, so that's a re very realistic number. Uh, if you're working on school projects and whatnot, nine hours is definitely going to hold you over for the day while at school. Over here you have like a glasses holder, but we've got some earbuds. Uh, these are actually the Beats Flex. So I like these. Uh, I've been, I've been a fan of these kind of earbuds for years. The ones that had like the little neck band design makes it nice and easy to be able to take these around. You don't have to worry about them falling out. If you're not into truly wireless earbuds uh, because you might be afraid of losing them or maybe you know, you're picking this up for someone younger and you don't want to spend a lot of money on truly wireless earbuds because they might not be super responsible. You know, some students are really young. Uh, this is a really solid option because you can't really lose it. So it'll pair very easily with Apple devices. It has 12 hours of battery life, so you can be on this thing all day and uh, not really have to worry about it. And it only goes for like 36 bucks, you guys. Uh, definitely affordable for students. And they're Beats. Kids still like Beats, right? There you go. Kid approved by Carl. <laughs> uh, you also have this compartment like right under it. But check this out, guys. You open it up here. And it's like Narnia. You, you weren't expecting that call, right? You got this huge compartment down here uh, where you can store all kinds of things. You can throw your keys on here so you can have this as part of your keychain. Throw it in here when you're in class. So we've already seen two large compartments uh, for the laptop and right here. Then you've got this guy. So here you've got even more space. Obviously, I don't, know, I don't have it filled up to the brim. Uh, but we've got some headphones over here. And these guys right here are the Soundcore Life Q30s. Now, these are a pair of headphones by Soundcore, which is an anchor brand. They make the, like the portable chargers and cables, uh, but they've gone on into the audio world. Uh, and these are actually really solid headphones. Uh, these go for about 80 bucks. Uh, but they've got all the premium features that you'd want. So you've got active noise canceling. I believe they have like a transparency mode so you can hear what's going on around you. So these are over the ear headphones. So your ears are sitting inside, but the cushions are really, really soft. So that is a nice bonus so that if you're, you know, traveling to school, you're, you know, commuting, uh, you can wear this for long periods of time with no worries. And this actually has an insane amount of battery life. Carl, guess how long? Eight hours? Jay, guess how long? This actually has 40 hours of battery life with active noise canceling on and 60 hours without active noise canceling. Absolutely insane stuff. I don't, huh? I don't believe that. You don't believe it? I'm, listen, man, it's, it's, it's here. I'm gonna test it out. You're just trying to get the headphones, Carl. <laughs> get out of here. Uh, I like how they are foldable, uh, so you can fold them. The ear cups rotate. Uh, it's super lightweight, but it doesn't feel cheap. Uh, this is a really decent investment for just 80 bucks. Uh, they also have multi-point connection, so you can connect this to like your phone and your laptop at the same time and not have to worry about switching between the two. You can just have them both connected at the same time which is super convenient. Now, something I also like about these headphones is they have like those classic button features. I never realized how much I would miss these, but you can control 
the volume and stuff right from these buttons over here. So volume up, volume down, play and pause over here. So I, I never realized how much I would miss that, but I kind of like the controls uh, just being available with just like a tap. It's nice. This thing also has a feature kind of like the Sony headphones that we've seen in the past where you can kind of hold it for like two seconds. And I believe you can hear what's going on around you. Transparency. What's going on, Carl? How you doing today? Doing all right. It's a funky feature. It's not something a lot of people would have used. They probably just, what? <laughs> but it's available. So it's surprising. It's surprising what you can get here for just 80 bucks. Uh, lots of premium features, amazing battery life. Sound is pretty good too. So it's a solid investment. Definitely worth taking to school with you for the next year. So we've got the earbuds and the headphones down. Definitely great stuff. Uh, but remember, like I said, that this backpack has that USB port over here, so you can connect a portable charger. Uh, we've actually talked about this portable charger in the past. Uh, this one is from RAV Power. You've got 15,000 milliamp hours, so you will be able to charge your phone over and over with this guy. What I like about it is that it has a built-in screen, so you know just how much charge your portable charger has left. So once you see this thing drop down to like 10% or something, you know it's time to charge it up. It also has fast charging, so it has USB PD. So if you wanna fast charge your iPhone, your Galaxy, whatever it might be, you've got the USB-C port here to do that, as well as a regular USB type A port. Uh, this guy is so small and compact and has such a high capacity. I personally love this thing. It's super easy to take around with you and you can just kind of throw it in here, not really worry about it. It's an easy deal. Now, of course, we've got a little something for the laptop over here. Uh, we've got some storage. You're always going to need extra storage just in case, you never know. So I personally like the Samsung T7 Touch. Now, the reason why I like this is because if you're taking it to school and you know you've got files on here that need to be secure, you actually have a fingerprint scanner right up here. So only you can get inside of it. I love this feature. I think having security on your drives is really important. So it's cool that Samsung added that here. And these aren't very expensive. So you can pick this up on Amazon for like 90 bucks at 500 gigs. And if you want like a terabyte, I believe it's 189. Two terabytes is kind of expensive. You're looking at 369 on Amazon. And it's super compact. Like this thing you can throw in your pocket. You can have it in one of these. It just makes it really easy to take your stuff around with you. I think this is a must. Now here's something cool for you guys that you might not have heard about. So here we have a notebook. This one is by Moleskin, but it's not your standard notebook. So this right here is the Moleskin Smart Writing Set Ellipse. So that's the name of it. So this is like your standard notebook, right? It looks pretty normal, but you've got a very special pen over here. So check this out, guys. So you've got your fancy pen here with a built-in camera at the top, and you've got this notebook. And when you're ready to take notes, you can just go, let's see, eight, 10, oh, actually take the 12th, right? Whatever. Do you see that, guys? Instantaneous. As you write, it shows up right in the app. So while you're actually physically writing down notes for class, you get a digital copy right on your phone. So if you're taking notes like your average consumer is the best tech YouTuber with the worst hand writing, you can go ahead and have that all synced up digitally and physically. That's super cool. Cause I don't know about you guys, but I personally enjoy writing with a pen and pencil, even though I have such horrible penmanship. It's just really cool to be able to just write whatever you need to down. And you've got yourself a digital copy over here without even thinking about it. Now it's crazy because this pen will only work with this book. Uh, but of course, if you run out of pages, you can get an, a replacement book. Uh, but if you try to use it with another book of some sort, it's not gonna work. Molson's got some crazy technology in here, you guys, to make this thing work. And you can even take your handwritten text and put it into regular digital text. So like with a regular font, you can copy and paste, throw it into other applications or emails, whatever it might be. You can do a lot with the things that you write. You can also sync it up to Google Drive or Evernote, all very seamlessly. I think this is really cool. 
And you know, this is definitely not on the cheap end. This is some pretty expensive stuff, but this is the baller edition. How much do you think it costs, Carl? You know, I'm not even gonna ask you. It's a lot more than you think. It's 150 bucks. I was about to guess that. Were you really? For real. Yeah, right. Do they have bigger notebooks? I'm not sure if they have bigger ones, but if they do have larger size notebooks, I'll have it linked down below in the description. You need that, because your handwriting, you know, you can just change the font. And change You're not wrong. Thing. You're not wrong. Just change up the font after I write. I got chicken scratch, so I get it. Thanks, Carl. <laughs> oh, that's kind of cool, too. It has the LED over here, kind of letting you know it's on. Yeah, micro USB cable. Now that's pretty much what we have inside of the backpack, but of course there's more. I'm trying to factor in the fact that some students won't be going into a classroom or they might be doing work in a dorm room. So we've got a couple of other options. Uh, this right here is this really cool laptop desk, I guess you can call it, that you can use on a couch or a bed. So if you're taking your classes, you can let me just show you the setup. So let's say you gotta attend your class, you're in your room or your living room, wherever it may be, uh, you, but you don't have access to a desk, or maybe you wanna just be able to sit somewhere comfortable while you're in class, you can go ahead, pop this thing out. It's almost like that those breakfast in bed uh, type of setups that you can just have here. You've got a nice little wrist rest for your wrist when you're using your mouse, and you've got this thing over here to hold your laptop. So if you decided to go ahead and tilt this thing, you can go ahead and do that comfortably. And you can even prop up your phone. So for me personally, with there being virtual classes that you can attend pretty much anywhere, uh, I think this is a solid buy uh, so that you can, you know, be comfortable, have a nice little workstation uh, pretty much anywhere you want. So I almost forgot to mention the fact that there's a drawer here as well. So if you've got little tiny notebooks, that you wanna pop out, you can go ahead and do that. You can, you know, keep your storage in here as well. Uh, so this is nice. Imagine taking this thing around, uh, making sure you have everything that you need for class, and it's even height adjustable, uh, which is nice too. You can adjust the height of the legs. I'm not gonna lie, you guys, this is a nice setup. Well, of course, it is. that's why I picked it. I look like a student? <laughs> That means I'm doing my job, Carl. I'm blending in. Now let's say you don't want this mobile setup. You've got a desk, something you can reliably sit at. Let me show you this awesome chair. So this right here, you guys, is a gaming chair that I found on Amazon. I believe it goes for less than a hundred bucks. And it's actually really comfortable. I remember back in the day when I was first making, getting my setup together, I went to like Staples to go check out chairs and they can be really, really expensive. But now Amazon has a bunch of options. This one has nice soft padding. So you can sit here for a while, not worry. Now you only get the standard uh, height raising ability with these. You can't control how far back it goes, but you can just lean if you want, uh, but you can't set the back any further. It's kind of like one position. But I just feel like it has like, you know, nice soft padding. It's really comfortable. So at its price range, I find it pretty easy to recommend. But one thing, if you don't want the handles here, you can always throw them back so you can just have like a regular sitting experience. But honestly, these handles feel really nice. So there's no way I wouldn't have them. But maybe you gotta just like, you know, push them back, get deep in here, get into your work, right? That's what people do. They take their work seriously. Yeah, focus with some Apex. <laughs> but I think that's about it for this year's baller edition of our back to school guide. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Uh, if there are any other cool things that I think you guys should check out that might cost a little bit more, uh, but I think is worth the investment, I'll have it linked down below in the description. So definitely check that out. I'll also have the budget edition of this video down below as well. So we have a cheaper version that you can check out as well. But that about wraps it up for this video, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. I'm sorry you have to go back to school, uh, but I'll catch you guys in the next one. Till then, it's your average consumer. Peace. Aren't you glad you're done with school, Carl? Of course. You know, you know. <laughs>